Good morning! I am so excited for today's video. I purchased a rainbow vacuum and we are going to use it today, see if it's worth the money, and just totally deep clean my house. So I would be lying if I said I haven't used it already. We actually purchased it literally yesterday. <laughs> and I was up until 9 p.m., which is way past my bedtime. <laughs> I get up at like five, but despite all that, I was up until 9 p.m. vacuuming the snot out of our basement carpet, and it was gnarly what I found down there. So I will include a little picture, maybe a little video, and yeah, I'm curious to see what the rest of the house comes up with in terms of dirt, gunk, all the things. So let me show you the rainbow. There it is in all its glory, going from last night. Naturally, the girls have already destroyed the basement. That's okay. So here it is. It has been purifying the air since last night. So let's just look at this quickly. See what has come out. Okay. So you can see the water is very cloudy and you can see like that dark gray stuff there, there. That is all, I think, dirt and I don't know what that it has picked up. So this is nothing, by the way. We're going to attach the vacuum right there and take this bad boy upstairs and I'm going to do our floors and see what comes out. There's a better view of it. You can see all the dirt. Okay, so before I get into telling you about the attachments and stuff that come with the vacuum, I want to just tell you about some of the specs and what sold me as this unit is pricey gonna cost you an arm and a leg in the whole house so just like forewarning you it is expensive the reason that we were so intrigued by it is the fact that it is a zero filter water filtration system so to speak now I don't sell it I'm not a rep I'm not a distributor I have no like this is not sponsored nothing okay and I could also be botching some of this so bear with me but they are approved by the asthma and allergy association which is a big deal as our entire family does struggle from allergies. And so that was a huge seller for us. The second one was again, the no filter. So we all know how expensive filters are. We all know that when you buy a filter, you have to end up replacing it however long down the road, three months, six months, a year, whatever, right? We have no pets. We used to have a dog, but we have no pets. We just have children. And it is disgusting the amount of dog hair that came out of our carpet still that I have cleaned on numerous occasion, including I purchased a professional carpet cleaner from Home Depot and ran that over the carpet I think one or two times since getting rid of our dog and like it's crazy how much the rainbow vacuum still picked up it's just truly incredible so far I again I've had it for like 24 hours but so far I am impressed now don't ask me how it works I have like they lost me during the presentation <laughs> You can get your own presentation. I can put a link down below and you can find one local to you. Um, however, they will try and sell you a rainbow vacuum at the end of it. Just kind of like make note of that. You don't, there is no obligation. You get a free air purifier if you do go through my link. But um, yeah, they will try and sell you one. You might get suckered in. Lots of people say it's a scam. Um, mainly because they have incentives for you to get a free rainbow vacuum which in my opinion is wild how much they ask you to do for a free rainbow and I understand it is a hefty price and our rep was like well they have to cover their butts they have to whatever but I'm like well yeah but like that's also part of business so anyway I'm just very opinionated so there's that okay that's rainbow in a nutshell let's get into the attachments and the cleaning so the Rainmate is a $300, these are all Canadian prices by the way, air purifier that you get for free. So this is the unit, this is on full blast, you can kind of hear it. So those are the two settings. I just have it going on number two constantly and it's picked up a little bit, not a whole heck of a lot, but it is. it does 300 square feet in your house and I mean, the our living room is wide open into the dining area the kitchen and all the things so maybe that's why it's not doing the best at picking up the air as the space is just too big so i might put it in our bedroom and see how it does there this is everything that is included in it so you have the base here which has this little water thing underneath that is what i emptied 
um, it just kind of slides in, right? And I need to put more water in here and then some oils to help purify the air and leave a scent that I like. Um, so I've been using their eucalyptus, which smells really good. And then this is obviously the vacuum. So the attachments are this pole here, this pole here, and that is an attachment. Then in the box came all of these. And so like there's so many different ones for different things. I honestly don't even know what they all do. Um, but yeah, there's some pretty cool attachments here, which is really nice that it does come with that when you're paying as much as you are. And then this one, which you can see has some hair on it from when I used it yesterday. Um, but I honestly find, actually I'll tell you the pros and cons after, so stay tuned. So in a nutshell, that is all that is included in it. Oh, and this bag, which you can put pillows and stuff in it, which I will share um, a little bit later in the video. All right, let's get some water filled up in here and start in the back of the house, which is the master bedroom. All right, so that little thing, the top of it is the max fill line. So I filled it just below it and I will put it back in the thing. It still has some stuff in it, but for the most part, it is clean. So this piece is magnetized and just fits into the hair. You just kind of clip it in like that and it's ready to go. That is literally just from our bedroom, which is pretty small, like very small area, especially our furniture takes up a lot of it. Um, so yeah, you can just see everything in the water. Now I'm going to switch attachments. I'm gonna put this little one on and get like behind the bed.
friend who can't let go But when you left I could feel it grow Like a body of Okay, are you ready for this? I haven't even looked at it. I'm gonna turn the camera around and share our force with you. So this is as much as I have seen. I have not taken it out and looked at it. But as you can see, it's gonna be pretty gnarly. This is from our main floor, okay? So keep that in mind. Oh my gosh. So gross how much it picks up. All right, I got new water down in the bottom. I got my blue bag filled with pillows, blankets, and all the things. And we are going to suction it out and show you what happens. Don't wanna wake up, I might be dreaming. I might be dreaming You're stirring things up My heart is beating My heart is beating I won't let go I can't say no So the longer you leave it on, the more it will pull out But as you can see, it pulled all of that off the pillows and blankets And there's some sand at the bottom, which Yeah, is really exciting So there's lots of things that you can do with this thing I'm gonna do some of my other pillows off camera, but you get to the gist of it. We are back in my bedroom. The water remained the same after I did our pillows that we sleep on and um, the blankets in here. So, I've stripped the bedding and I'm going to put on the small attachment and do the mattress, see what comes out. Okay, it is quite dirty from our bed. It's very murky and kind of a light gray. So gross. All right, so that is the rainbow vacuum in action. You've seen it. Now let's kind of talk about the pros and the cons. Okay, I had to sit down for this one. So let's talk cons first. So the cons is number one, it's really heavy. And this was one of the things I had read online with the reviews after people had purchased it. And I was like, well, like, you knew how heavy it was when you purchased it. But I was so sore this morning after vacuuming our basement with it. Um, and I like as I was like maneuvering it around, I didn't think it was too heavy for me or anything like that. Um, but again, my body was telling me this morning, maybe I'm just getting old. 
but if you are somebody who is older or just not very strong don't have like the the strength the upper body strength to like lift it around um it might not be the vacuum for you another con is i feel like when you are just like purifying the air like it just doesn't clean as much as when you are vacuuming and they claim that it does 3,000 square feet which is a ton and that like as long as like all the doors and stuff are open like it will do like the top and the bottom but i don't know about that so that's just my opinion though another con the price it's four thousand dollars canadian um, plus taxes and so yeah it's a very very expensive vacuum pros disgustingly satisfying i mean you guys saw those before and afters which truly speak for themselves i i feel like i'm a pretty clean person i clean a lot i am a professional cleaner and yeah i'm i'm shocked at how much came out of our our house I can't believe I'm showing this on the internet, but here we are. Another pro, they say that you can write it off um, for like a medical expense. If you are someone who suffers from like allergies, uh, asthma, that sort of thing, or you just have like really bad lungs because they are approved by the, I can't remember the name of it, Asthma and Allergy Association of America, I think, or something like that. Um, and so they say that you can write it off. We have not done that. So I don't even know what the process of that would be because I do suffer from allergies. I have eczema, I have asthma, my husband has asthma, my girls have allergies, like all the things. And so I wonder if it would be something we could write off. So yeah, let me know down below what you guys think. If you have had one, let me know down below in the comments. If so, how long have you had it? Did you buy one? Did you return it? Like I would love to open this conversation up down below in the comments. Let me know what you guys think. And if you want to add any other pros and cons, I'd love to hear those as well. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in my next video. Bye.